Hi everyone, welcome to my second attempt to do a vlog. <laughs> and today is Sunday, 1st of December, so it's the first advent and I just have night shifts. <laughs> As you may see it, here's the hospital. And yeah, I had my first night shift, no, not my first, sorry, my sixth. And now I'm done for the week. And I will have like one and a half day off. I know it sounds really uh, less, and it's true because it's not normal usually to work that much. But um, yeah, it's okay. Uh, we will work for it. Who cares? So yeah, I had a pretty good night. Didn't have that much to do. And today I'm just gonna go home now. We have like 8.15 in the morning and I ate breakfast at the hospital and now I'm on my way home. After <coughs> or before I go home, I would, I'm gonna go to the post because I have to pick up some stuff that I order that I'm gonna show it to you guys what it is. And let me see if this is the bus I have to take, no. And yeah, so what I will do now, I drink some coffee now in the morning and I ate a croissant, so I will try to sleep a little bit. Like I think I will try to sleep until maybe approximately 12, like three hours, because otherwise I can't sleep in the night. And yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do. And I'm just waiting for the bus. It will come in 10 minutes, yeah, 10 minutes. So we have 10 minutes to talk, <laughs> that's good. I look horrible, I look so horrible. Like I have like darkness, like dark circle under my eyes. I'm so sorry, but I'm really, really tired. And yeah, so before I go home, I'm gonna pick up some stuff at the post, two, stuff, two things that I ordered, and then I'm gonna sleep until 12 approximately. And then me and my husband are gonna do something. I don't know yet what. We probably gonna I have no idea what we will do today. It's Sunday, so usually on Sunday we don't do that much. He will probably go to the gym and me to sleep, and then maybe we go out to eat, I think. So that's good. I'm gonna show you my outfit of the day or the night. So just a person came, and I don't wanna vlog in front of people. Like, I'm comfortable, but not that comfortable. I'm just hoping that she will take the bus now, <laughs> so she will go. Who is up at sat at eight in the morning? Like I don't on a Sunday. Like I don't understand. <laughs> like this is typical my luck. I'm gonna show you my outfit of the day when she goes. Let's hope that she does. I look so tired today. I'm so sorry. Like I look really, really tired. Yeah, she will go now. Thank God. I'm in a desperately need to um, go to the hairdresser to put to put up my extensions. Right now, my extensions are here, my taping extensions, and I really need to put them up again because now I feel like they they're not that cute anymore. So it has been like two months, so I really need to do it right now. But I'm really lazy. That's the problem with me. I'm so lazy to go to the hairdresser. It's not the funniest thing for me. Like it's always such a project. So, I never want to go, but yeah, now I have to. So yeah, I'm sorry, I'm always touching my hairs. So I'm gonna show you the outfit of the day I'm doing here because people are always watching me, like, all the time. Um, so, the jacket that I have on is the one from Zara, uh, last season, I think it is. Um, then I have my uh, Gucci scarf. It's from, it's my husband's, and I just wear it all the time because I love it so much. Then I have the like a turtleneck top with like long sleeves that I love from Wolford. Like I use it a ton during winter and autumn. So I love it so much. Then I have my Gucci bag, Gucci Marmont in velvet. So for shoes, I have my Steve Madden high thigh boots in suede or velvet, whatever you want to call it. I love them so much and then I have my uh, tights from Caledonia, the shape control one in 30 uh, den 
then I have my amazing new skirt that I bought from Zara. It was 40% off on the Black Friday auction. And I love it so much. It's the beige one. I also have it in black. And yeah, that's it. I'm here right now waiting for the bus it will come in six minutes it's sad so yeah so yeah that was my outfit of the day and i will check with you later okay bye so the stuff that i order are here i ordered two stuff from two things from douglas douglas um they had like 30 percent off for black friday so that's what i bought and i will show you after what it was you guys i just woke up i slept until 2 30 um and that's why i'm not showing my face because i looked horrible um and i have a pajama on so that's not that cute um i want to show you that i did my first event so first happy first event to you all this is mine i made it myself last year and this time this year I also took it back again. I love it so much. And of course I have my Christmas plant and the Christmas tree there. So this is my decoration for the holidays. So I just wanna show you what I got in the mail today. The first thing, let's talk about this one. Sorry, my nail is horrible. Um, this is the Yves Saint Laurent or Saint Laurent Other Parfum Intense in Black Opium. And this one is the new version of the Black Opium. Um, and my mom has it. And I love it so, so much. So that's why I decided to uh, purchase it as well. I'm gonna show you after. I'm gonna open it up so you guys can check it out. So this is the first thing. And then the second thing is something that I wanted to try for a very long time. Like, I already tried a lot, but I just like try the samples ones. So when I purchase a lot of stuff from La Mer, the counter, the, the sales associate always give me a lot of samples. And the one that I always ask for are is the concentrate. I love it so much, it's a serum and has the most amount of the miracle broth and it's supposed to be like a serum for healing uh for example if you have burn like burn somewhere you can put that one on um it also helps for example if you had um a dermatologist laser like a chemical laser or like you went to a dermatologist and you made um how you say um you made a treatment uh, you can use this one to calm your skin down. Um, of course, it has uh, properties also for uh, anti-wrinkles. And I have been using this for the longest time, but just the sample ones because it's a lot of money. It costs a lot, this little bottle. It's just uh, 15 uh, milliliters, uh, so it's very, very expensive. And I couldn't really justify spending that much money on a serum. So I always wear, like I always use the samples and it's amazing. It's just unbelievable. The skin looks so good, so calm and so uh, smooth. Um, so I really wanted to give it a try. Of course, I'm not gonna use it man uh, morning and night. I'm just gonna use it during uh, the nights and not every night. Like I'm just gonna be really careful to using it. Um, yeah, but I'm so excited for it and I'm gonna also do um, a first impression, or not your first impression, but I'm just gonna do it, a review on it on my channel because um, I'm just, I love it so so much and I have another product or ha oh I think I have two new products from La Mer that have been using for the longest time so I'm also gonna do a review about that as well so let me open it up and show you how everything looks so here they are um, now I'm not that sure I pick up the right one on this one because I think it's a little bit too intense like i don't remember it to be that intense so i have to ask my mom if it's the correct one i don't know i put it on but i'm not that sure i think probably i bought the wrong one the one that i wanted was like this one should be a little bit more like bl blue and it's not it's like see-through 
and I'm worried I bought the wrong one. Hmm. And the concentrate is the concentrate. Like I love the package so much, so that's it. Hmm. Good morning, guys. Today is really early. It's like eight in the morning. I woke up at like at six. I went um, just woke up because today I have a really exciting day. I'm meeting uh, my friend. Minella is like one of my best friends and we're meeting in the city, we're meeting in Zurich today so I have to take the train really early this morning uh, so that's why I didn't uh, start vlogging first, th first thing in the morning um, so today I'm just in Starbucks right now I'll show you what I bought, I just took a much more drink and I'm just in Starbucks waiting for the train I'm a little bit early, like I'm 20 minutes earlier so I'll so stay a little bit and yeah, we're just meeting today in the city. I can't wait. We're going to our favorite um, cafe. It calls like Cafe Elena. It's amazing. It's like you have walls full with flowers and everything. So it's really, really uh, beautiful. And the, their breakfast is amazing there. So that's why we want to meet each other and just uh, enjoy the time together. Like we have a whole day together. So we're just gonna shop a little bit, uh, check the Christmas market in Zurich, and I will bring you guys with me. So I'm really, really excited about that. Um, yeah, so um, after I'm gonna show the outfit of the day, now it's a little bit, a little bit washing, so. <laughs> but I will show you after, okay? So you guys can see it. So now I'm on the train. <clears throat> I can't speak that loud because now it's like a silent first class so I can't talk that loud but uh, yeah I'm so exciting to finally go to Zurich to meet my friend I've been I haven't been there now in a month so it's really weird for me I'm always there when I try to go so yeah I'm really excited a little bit of the outfit of the day you can see well, we'll show you proper after how I look today Hi everyone, I just arrived at the train station in Zurich and I'm going now to uh, find Minella to see where she is. I don't think she arrived yet. She's parking her car, I think. So I'm just going to walk through um, the train station and then I'm gonna go to the cafe and waiting for her there. So let's see. Um, yeah, I'm gonna show you also, they have a cute um, Christmas market also inside the train station. It's really, really cute. So I'm gonna show you also how it looks. It's pretty cute. Perfect. I'm gonna show you the Christmas market. I went on the wrong side, so I just walked out and then we missed, but I don't know if it's open yet. Maybe it's not open yet, it looks really close. Oh, it's close. Oh, that was really sad. But this one is the Christmas market, so it hasn't opened yet. I don't know when it will open, but that's really sad. It's really cute. It's the train station. But it, yeah. yeah, it's really sad, it's close, so there's not something to see. I'm just waiting for Minella, she's a little bit late, let's see, look how beautiful the sun is and let's see if she comes so I can show you guys around. <laughs>
my outfit of the day. Uh, so now I'm on my way. I'm already home. I'm on the lift on the elevator. Um, and yeah, so I'm just gonna show you the outfit of the day. So for earrings, I have my. I don't know if the camera can pick it up. Yeah, here, my Chanel earrings. I don't know if the camera can focus. Yeah, no. Um, I have my teddy coat. This teddy coat is from Mango, the white one in XS. I love it so much. I bought this one in uh, Dubai um, because here it was almost impossible to find the size because it was sold out everywhere. So in Dubai they had one and I bought it. And the, the, the thing that I have up, the top that I have is the same than yesterday. It's the top from Wolford. Uh, the black one, the black with turtleneck and long sleeves. It's a bodysuit, of course. Then I have my scarf. This is the scarf of my husband, the Gucci one. Um, then I have the Gucci belt, the normal Marmont Gigi. And then I have the leather skirt from Zara, tights from Caledonia. And the shoes are the high fi boots high-five boots from Steve Madden and of course the bag is my Chanel Vintage 2.55 in the medium size for accessories I do have my Hermes uh, CDC bracelet or Collier de Chen bracelet and watch I have the rose filled with silver and gold hardware so this is the outfit of today so now I'm home and um, yeah, I just arrived. I didn't vlog that much today because I just wanted to enjoy my time with Minella. We don't see us that much. Of course we work together, but because of the shift, we don't see us that much. So we, we, we do have some quality time with each other. I don't want to vlog that much. And yeah, so that's why. So we went to Cafe Elena, as you guys saw. Yeah, as you guys saw, we went to Cafe Elena. It was really beautiful, packed with people. Like it was just an hour open. Like we went at 10 instead of nine and it was packed with people. So the best seat was of course um, occupied. So that was a little bit of a pity, but it was enjoyable anyway. The food, it's always so good. I ate an acai ball. A pink lemonade I drank and I also drank a pink latte. It is done with red beets. It's done with red beets. And so it's not a really a coffee. Um, it's just, it's pink latte just because it's made with latte and uh, red beets. And it smells really good and it tasted also really good. I didn't expect that. So I drank that and Minella drank an orange juice. Um, fresh press and also an acai ball like me. I'm a huge fan of acai ball. If I could, I could eat it like every day, three times a day because it's so good. So then afterwards, we just went to Manor um, where they have Sephora inside. I bought something, I'm gonna show it to you. One thing is a, a Christmas present for my sister-in-law, so I can't show it to you guys uh, because she will probably see this vlog and I don't want, don't wanna uh, ruin the surprise, but it's a beautiful thing I bought for her. Uh, so I'm show you the other stuff that I bought and then afterwards we just went to um, Louis Vuitton but it was like 50 minutes waiting list so I didn't went in and Gucci it was not that that good of an experience they were really rude as usual um, like I don't understand the service in every store in Milan it's so great and in Zurich I don't know what the problem is like in Chanel they're so kind and in Dior yeah they're okay um, Louis Vuitton also they're really good but the Gucci store in Zurich I don't know what it is I'm so sorry to say tell you that but it's like the service is so bad I went in I wanted to buy something for my mom oh my god maybe she's gonna see it uh, anyway I'll tell you I want to buy her something and then I ask for the sales associate and she say yeah we have it but you do have to wait because I'm giving service to another person and I say no problem I will be right back so that was really happy. So I, I was waiting. That's not a problem for me to wait. And then I was waiting and waiting. And then suddenly uh, the guard uh, of the store, or the security of the store say to her, ah, uh, by the way, um, have a great lunch. So she just left. She gave, she helped, she helped the person before me. And then she just went to lunch. 
And I'm like, are you kidding me? Like you could have said to someone else to come and help me. But there were like two people inside the store, three people inside the store. No one was getting service. And I really wanted to buy something and I was standing there waiting like a stupid person. And I'm like, no, what? I don't do that. I can buy it online. I can buy it on the Gucci website. I can buy it on my Teresa. I can buy it in Luisa Via Roma. I don't have to be treated like this, you know? I wanted to buy it. So I didn't care. I went out. I said, Milan, let's go. <laughs> because I don't want to be treated like this. Also, if I just wanted to, to watch, you know, you have to really take care of your customer. Like, I'm never going to go there again. And the problem also with the Gucci store, they have a new policy policy that you have to stand outside uh, they have like a really long line before you can actually go in the store so maybe they have like they just help people two to three people each time and the other one have to wait outside so no thank you but this time there was no line so I thought perfect I could just walk in and ask and then they were so rude to me so no sorry I, I'm not going to purchase there anything I can purchase online or I can actually go to Milan and purchase it there is the service always amazing so in Rinascente they're perfect also in the Gucci store in Via Sant'Andrea they're amazing so I mean I don't need that right uh yeah let me show you what I bought so I just took away the present for my sister-in-law, so you guys can't see it. This one is the packaging of the Sephora that they have there, like it's in the Monarch store. So the first thing is that I bought, it's a repurchase, and it's the Huda Beauty, um, let's see if it focuses, Resting Boss Face. This is the waterproof setting spray, ultra matte finish. I love this um, setting spray. I already did an, a review on it on my channel you can check it out if you will i love this so much uh, the makeup doesn't move it stays on so good and it's very matte today i'm really oily because i didn't use this one because mine is finished that's why i repurchased it the one that i use today is the caudalier one the um it's actually like a mist uh beauty elixir it calls and it's too much glowy you know and i don't want to look that oily you know so this one is actually perfect so i rebought this one then I rebought my favorite foundation right now is the Too Faced Born This Way foundation, all free medium.